You know, I think it's kind of wild, the difficulty jump in this video. So you'll see I get on a boss fight in a little bit. <laughs> it's insane. This has been a really fun series to cover, and I cannot thank you enough for the support on each video. The likes as well mean a lot to me, especially like the longer parts. If you like it like this, just keep it up, and I'll keep delivering. All right, love you all. Let's go ahead and get this. And we're back. All right, so here's where we are in the story right now. So we got the next Ronin mission, which is actually like the main path. Going to continue that for now. Uh, Equipment-wise, nothing really changed since the last video. I did like a little bit of exploration. I ran like run around and fight just random enemies. Nothing's really changed. I might have upgraded a few of the actual stats. Combat styles, I'm still kind of learning those. We got a lot of the stuff locked. Because it's all dealing with like bond levels of different people, I'm guessing. Because you got... Yeah, you got like different types. I want to get all these titles and stuff. I want to get like the gear sets. Look at that. Man. I cannot wait to keep exploring. Anyways, here we go. Oh, heading home, are you? I heard you're looking for someone who came on the black ships. Taka told me. So, did you find out anything? I'm gonna say yes, I did. There you go. See, I told you this was the place to come. And there's more. I know there was that incident, but Katsura's a fellow worth knowing. He might well need your help with this and that. I recommend staying on his good side. I'll warrant his head's cleared by now, so maybe you should pay him a visit. He's staying at the Sakura Inn. Head there now and you'll catch him. I bet he can help you find whoever it is you're looking for. I'm going to keep searching for Master Shoin. Once I find him, I'll introduce you. I promise. You and I are true friends now. No doubt about it. If you're ever in trouble, just let me know. That's a true friend. All right. How far away is this? Wait, is it really right here? So here's what I did. I went to the first region and I kind of just got the 100% for it. I was missing like a cat. And there's a fugitive up there that I fought. It was a very short fight. Wouldn't really been worth showing. I saved all the other ones, though. I just want to see what happens when you get like 100% in one area. I don't want to like take away from the story and stuff. But all the other sections I'm going to keep for like videos. I just want to like test that out. I was just curious what happens when you like, I guess, complete everything, you know? All right. So we're going to go over there. It looks like it's right next to us. We also got this right here, which is a level 10. No thanks. <laughs> that sounds like it might be a little tough. Let's just walk over here. I could use the horse, but it seems like a little unnecessary for this area. I've had a lot of fun with this game. We're on, like the fourth video, but thank you all for supporting like the longer parts. Wasn't going to do that, but once I saw the open world thing pop up, I was like, yeah, let's just uh let's just keep at it. Alright, encountering other Ronin. Let's see. Wanted level. Proficiency in weapons, but you will okay. Wanted level. I don't really want to get involved in that. Unless we're about to for the story's sake. Oh, so one thing we did get in that last video, we can actually change. So if we just use the watch, change it to noon. I'll actually show you how it actually looks. A little grainy, a little slow motion, kind of. The frames drop, but we're chilling. I like that you can interact with almost every, every animal in the game. It feels like horses. You can collect cats. We're just stealing eggs. I don't know why. <laughs> Haven't we met somewhere? Ah, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh -huh. ah, I was sure you were a spy for the Shogun, but it turned out you were a drama. Sorry about all that. My memory is pretty hazy. Ah. Had a few too many again, did you? Sadly, yes. And they ended up getting soundly beaten by our friend here. To be honest, I might have struggled even stone cold sober. Your skill with the sword is quite something, but you seem to be self-taught. I recommend you test your metal at a proper dojo. Ganzui here is off to do just that. And he's no slouch when it comes to his studies either. No wonder he's showing Yoshida's favorite. <laughs> This accursed city is full of outsiders acting like they own the place. Removing them from our land calls for force. 
not diplomacy. Now is the time to show the world the tenacity of our place. In the name of this divine country. <sighs> there he goes again. I'm going gambling. I've been let us short on coin of late. Where are your manners, Shinsaku? Show our guests some courtesy. Want to join me? You seem like a lucky sort. I get the feeling you survived a few scrapes you shouldn't have. The more I play this game, the more I just absolutely love it. All right, faction bases. Here we go. We got pro anti neutral. Got you. So it's like a certain areas you don't want to be in, essentially. Got you. Do we have this banner? Hold on. Why are we? Why is it over there? What in the world? All right, we got that. Um, okay. So what is like the next thing we're doing? Unless that was what we're supposed to go do. Follow your blade. The suit actually pops up. I don't see anything. I mean, I'm guessing. Can we actually go in here? Let's see. Landmark visited. Okay. All right. Traded bases. Here we go. Blacksmith. Okay. Trader. Sell special weapons uniquely suited to characters belonging to their bases faction. Got you. What so different types. Of Interesting. Course. Look at this. So you have to have that type of currency. Got you. At 75. I got 62. Not enough. <laughs> got to do some farming when I'm not recording, I guess. It's all good. Please. Come again. I've been looking for you. Let's cut to the chase. There's someone I'd like you to meet. His name is Izo. He's from Tosa, like me. He's dealing with some bad guys and needs some backup. He's waiting for me in a shack near the Hodagaya post. Please stop by if you can. Man, every time I play so this long. game, I'm so excited. Say so he's waiting where? Hold on. We are tracking this, right? Let's see where it actually pops up, if anything. Oh, it's just right here. Why did it... I wonder why it, like, unequipped it, kind of? Well, not really unequipped it. I guess untoggled it. It's kind of weird. It may not look like it, but those two are fine, upstanding young men. I recommend you get to know them. Genzui's dojo is right here in Yokohama. And I have a good idea where Shinsoku is headed. Perhaps you might join them. It seems like the other ones are optional, but I always just go with the one that's like actually highlighted. Here we go. <laughs> Did Ryoma recommend me? I see his ability to connect people still surpasses my own. Listen, I have no problem helping you out. But I'll need a little something in return. Tell me, what do you make of the state of this nation? Here we are, with the Western powers circling us as we speak. And yet, the Red Demon speaks with America and brooks no opposition. He is intent on signing a treaty, which will be a disaster for us. This is truly a critical moment for Japan. Ah, uh, no, nothing of politics. Yeah, I'm going to go with that option because I really don't want to get involved. If I don't have to, I guess. You may have no interest in such matters now, but in time, I guarantee you will. The time has come to instill a new start for this nation. That is what Master Shoin and I have sworn to accomplish. But at this critical juncture, my comrade's whereabouts are unknown. Once that treaty is signed, it will be too late. Uh, if Sakamoto trusts you, and so will I. Our plan is to kill Harris, the American consul, and halt the negotiations. But in order to do that, we need more able warriors on our side. We would be grateful if you would see fit to join us. I have heard you are seeking the samurai who came on the black ship. Word is that they now serve as one of Harris's bodyguards. Once we attack the council, the one you seek will undoubtedly appear. 
This gives us common purpose, does it not? But there is no need to answer right away. If you wish to join us, meet us in front of the American consulate. I hope to see you there. So the boss is Harris we're going after, but the person that we saw in the prologue is going to be there. Interesting. All right, story branches. Here we go. So I wonder, like, there's different paths, it seems like. I don't know which one I actually go with yet. Neutral mission is actually an option, though. What is this other one, Mark? So we have two choices. What does this say? So you can go there, or you can go here. Uh, let me actually... Oh, maybe there's two different things. No, it's the same one. We gotta do both anyways. Okay, let's just go to the one in front of us. Yeah, I love playing this game a lot. It's just a really nice vibe to it. I guess it's because I've played a lot of, like, serious games. Now, this game does have a nice story as well, but it's just an open-world samurai game. And I feel like they kind of nailed the combat. Every time I've said it's easy, or easier than some of the other ones, like Neo and stuff, it always, like, backfires. <laughs> So I'm going to just not say anything else because the game is probably going to get tougher as we go. But how do we actually get in here? I'm assuming we just go through the front, right? Or maybe not. Uh, let me just go around. Hold on. Can't climb that, I don't think. Yeah, you can't even go up there. Okay. We'll go around the other side right here. Yeah, here we go. Makes more sense. There's the banner as well. Here we go. There's a lot of vendors in this game. There's a lot of just like characters that you bond with. There's just so much story that I'm just kind of like fully grasping at as I go. Please, this. Ah, oh, you have returned. I heard something rather interesting from Kichi. The American consulate is in a state of panic. It seems they're bracing for an attack from a group intent on taking Mr. Harris's life. A sympathetic soul must have let their tongue slip. Perhaps in the confusion, you could seize the opportunity to close in on Mr. Harris. I am sure the bodyguard with a demon claw will appear soon enough. Let's see, we can actually use the Intimidate one. I don't really know if I need to do that. I'm gonna do the top one. Well, why indeed? <laughs> I'll arrange to get you into the consulate. You'll join me there, won't you? Okay, so it's like picking sides essentially. Um I'm not sure which I want to actually go with first. <laughs> Or like, I, I know we can't do both, but I'm just not sure. Unless we're supposed to, let's see. Maybe it gives us like an option after we like check out both of them. Let's actually fast travel closer. To save a little time there. I could run across the town area, but it is what it is. Favorite part of the entire game so far is the open world aspects, but also the combat is a lot of fun. Enjoying that, I feel like the overall exploration is really good as well. It doesn't seem as limited as I thought it would be. Like, some open-world games are semi-open world, if that makes any sense. Oh, I could actually... Hold on, let me... <laughs> get my horse off. Horse just pulls up out of nowhere. I love it. Alright, here we go. Oh, wait. We got this next to us. We should actually unlock that really quick. Especially since it's right next to both markers. Oh, is it up there? Oh, it is! Oh, we could actually... Oh, man. This is going to be so much fun. You got ships in the background. It's kind of odd. I played Skull and Bones like earlier, <laughs> like this year, which feels weird to even say that because I played it like maybe a month ago, <laughs> if even that. And it's like pirate ship theme, and it's like now we're playing this, and it's got like the same type of setup. It's almost like the worlds could be kind of interchanged, I feel like. All right, so not really sure where to start with this mission because we have like two choices let me look around and see if there's like a chest somewhere hold on i haven't really got any trends mog i think i messed around with like in the last video but nothing crazy why is there like a ramp here <laughs> all right the two options are right here um let's just fly over here
Hey. Let me actually go talk to her really quick. Hold on. I actually want to see what they say really quick because I don't want to accidentally choose the wrong one. You're here. I knew you'd come. Now, I will help you, but I have a request. I want you to find out who is threatening Mr. Harris's life. And I want to know who's in charge. So, how about it? Do we have a deal? So we're kind of picking right now. And I don't really know, like, what to go with. Um... I'm not sure. Let's just try this one. Let's just go for it. That is a relief. Here's hoping you will find the samurai you are looking for. I'll alert you when the moment is right. I wonder if you can alternate, like, do a mission for them once and then back and forth. Okay, uh, select allies. It's shown there's, like, two spots, which makes you think, like, you can have, like, three people, but I don't know. Maybe that's like reserved for something else. Got one skill point. Let's see. I haven't done anything in this column. I did a little bit of charm just to kind of get some stuff started, I guess. The additional critical hit seems pretty substantial, but this column seems to cost a lot. Like five, five. Um, I don't have anything on this one. Let's just go for one of these, at least. Alright, I think we're good. Alright, mission started. Here we go. Assuming we just... Wait, can I actually... Alright, so there's two, like, I guess, elite enemies. I want to see, actually. Hold on. Because I did that, will... It's like a damage increase. So I didn't know if like it actually helps with arrows as well. Alright, landmark visited. Let's get this. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Oh, God. Man, this game was a lot of fun to play. I think I enjoyed as much as I have been. That's why I'm still kind of like... Doing like the longer videos so I can just like take my time exploring and all that. They're all up there and they're not even paying attention. So I wonder if I should go around. Okay, they're fighting over there. Hold on. That is a huge sword. Okay. There's so many enemies right here. They didn't give me the option to like an assassination though, which is kind of strange. They're like in the bushes, I can't even get over there. Um, this is actually better anyways. I love that spinning attack. So when you change the stances and all that, can I help you? The other abilities for like square and triangle when you actually hold R R1, it does like, it's like this jump. <laughs> it's so silly. Seems unnecessary, but it's pretty awesome. All right, so far so good. I haven't taken down any of the major foes. I'm wondering something really quick. Can I be out of combat inside a mission? Because I want to get my health back. I guess not. Whatever. Let's keep it going. They already saw me, I think. What? I was on the second floor, never mind. I'm gonna run around there really quick. Try to deflect it back. Here we go. 
Wait, what? Okay, hold on. You were looking the other way. Unless that was the other person this side. Can't really see from here. Hold on. Let him stand back up. Okay. There we go. Alright, that was pretty good. Got another skill point from that, too. Let me look around really quick. That rifle actually might be better. Uh, I didn't see anything back this way. Oh, we got more on the side. Hold on, hold on. A little bit of stealth here. This is tried out, you know. Uh, this is actually higher. Here we go. I feel like this game is going to be... That was smooth. Like, like, I don't know if it'll hit right at the start like Ghost of Tsushima did, but I feel like it's got a lot of potential. Can't get through there. Isn't there another way? I'm not sure if this is actually going to help or not. Yeah, that's my last arrow. Oh, well. Oh god. Might be enough. Nice. Alright, so far so good. I kind of like how the mission branches off into actually like a structured type setting. Once you accept the mission. Now the rifle, it actually says it's better by the arrow. Nice. A little quality of life there. I like that. Games that already have stuff like that. Okay, we got more enemies here. I'm wondering, can I... Can I head glitch on the stairs? <laughs> that would be crazy if you could. Oh, we got a banner. Hold on. Checkpoints inside of these missions is insane. And I love it. U.S. Navy. Okay. Is there anybody out here? Hold on. Looks pretty clear, I guess. We got somebody right here. Is there anybody in the other room? All right, this is higher, so we can actually... Let me go this way first. Hold on. I just messed up, I'm pretty sure. Huh? Yep, yourself. that's fine. Slowly getting used to the controls again. It's like I went like a day without playing and I'm like getting punished right now for it. You're dead. Oh. Bring it Ready and willing. I don't want to shoot them. Hold on. Wait, what? How do they shoot me through the... I'm actually trying to, like, parry it. Hold on. Can I shoot through this? I'm actually... Oh, I can. Nice. I was wondering, like, the hit detection there. I wasn't sure if I could or not. You bring it on. I like how they just instinctively throw the, uh... Stuff around. <laughs> I might get killed here because I hopped down. Perry, we're chilling. Okay. I want to find the other foe enemy. Hold on. I'm assuming to get back up top, I can just 
grapple from down here. Or maybe I gotta go actually go up the steps again. Get that room. Hold on. Let's look around really quick. One there. Hold on. Oh well. Let's just fight him head on. There's a chest here too. I really can't think of one, like, negative thing to say about this game. I mean, maybe people hate on the graphics if they want, but I don't really think that's a huge deal. Because, I, I, like, I love Elden Ring and, like, the Dark Souls types games. But, uh, those graphics are not that good ever. And I feel like the gameplay still holds up, you know? I'm just enjoying it. I want to go in there, but I don't want to, like... I feel like we didn't get everybody yet. Hold on. Because last mission we had, like, this. We had that major foe that we had to take down. Yeah, there's a banner right here as well. Which is kind of odd. It's like right here in the open. That's fine. Oh, there's a vendor inside the mission just standing here? Don't rush. Say what? Your time. Okay, ammo. Man, I'm tempted to buy more of that. I don't have a lot. Is that all? Uh, we could craft some as well. So my inventory is full right now, so I can't really do too much. Oh, let me dismantle some stuff. Do I have like... Wait, my inventory is out of 2,000. Or is it just because like maybe the inventory slots for like actually like bullet stuff is like a different type of inventory, I'm guessing? I don't know. We'll go to the ballroom here in a minute. I didn't see any other like foe enemies. Hold on. Oh, well. Maybe we're, like, in the next area. I just feel like this is about to be, like, a boss fight. You won't lay a finger on me! That's a weird twist. Now we gotta fight him. Okay. I might get destroyed here a couple times. Not too bad. Come on. I'm getting absolutely destroyed right now. I feel like just applying pressure is just so much more useful than everything else. I'm 100% going to die. Like I'm, I'm good. Cutting up there. No one will stand in my way. Hard to bet on this fight for what feels like thirty minutes. 
Maybe longer? <laughs> it's been a long journey. This is a tough fight, by the way. Not too bad. Not good enough. We just take this L, sir. Second phase time, get ready. No, I guess not. Watch out. How did that miss? There's no way. I like how he was just staring at me. <laughs> Here we go. I'm gonna just use one of these just to kind of like regain my health a little bit. That it actually works is kind of nice. <laughs> you put up a good fight. A tough fight, my goodness. There we go. Woo. We finally meet, and you do this. It out eventually. That was easily the toughest fight in the entire game. The difficulty scale just creeped up beyond belief. I was on that fight. I took notes. <laughs> I died like a half hour of my footage, and I'm like an hour in now. So what's that? A half hour? My goodness. That was a cool fight, though. I felt like I used all my resources. I... I don't know. That was just extremely tough. <laughs> can I... Wait, I can't go out that way. Let me, uh... Go around this way. Man, that was a huge spike. I actually thought... It even told me several times, like, you sure you want to retry? You can lower the difficulty to easy and get it done, but I did not want to do that, so... There we go. It seems there was quite the kerfuffle in there. Are you all right? Did you manage to find out who was threatening Mr. Harris? It was a bunch of thugs. Uh, I'm still going with the top one. Is that right? So it's our intimidating friend, Mr. Katsura. And did you see the samurai with the demon's claw? Sir? 
Speechcraft. Let's try this one. Well, you almost sounded like someone searching for a lost love. I suppose I felt a touch of envy. Regardless, you proved every bit as reliable as I thought. Do come see me if you ever need my assistance. I dare say I shall have more favors to ask. In spite of Harris's close call, the Treaty of Amity and Commerce was concluded at last. In the end, the Imperial Court did not assent. We did all we could to explain, but our words fell on deaf ears. And now, there are those who would have our heads, who believe we have slighted the Imperial Court. There is no other way. Should the time come when we must atone for this deed, I alone shall pay the price. With this momentous agreement, Japan opened up to the world. All right, report it back. We should complete the plot. Man, that was insane. All right, personal development. Let's see what we got. String of bond missions for certain characters may earn you special equipment. Got you. Well, we got on her good side. That's that's for sure. <laughs> bond transfer. What do we got here? Uh, move special effects from one piece of equipment to another. Oh wow. Jewels, money, materials. That's insane. All right. Man, I, there's so much depth to this game. It's like, as you kind of just start with it, it's almost like, is it a story-driven game? Or is it like Neo? Or what is it? It's like both. <laughs> the difficulty in that boss was insane. Okay, uh, level 8 mission. Tracked on Harris and search for clues. I guess we could go ahead and track that. So you can use the different icons on the map. Got you. So I'll talk to her again. Where's she at? She's over here, isn't she? She's always in the same spot, I think. I need to go by the shop because I used up... I'll actually show you. Did I get any points for that? Let's see. Okay, we got two skill points. I really want to get this because having four would have come in clutch, but I can't use normal skill points on that. So, Which is odd. Why is this in strength and not like... I don't know, intellect or dexterity or something else, you know? Man, coin acquisition actually sounds like it'd be really good right now. Because I can kind of see the value in it more than I did in the beginning. Uh, what else we got? Harder time tracking you. Pickpocketing, what is this? You have a wanted level. It's like Assassin's Creed Mirage, kind of. Alright, let's just, um... Let's just start spending these. I'm going to get both of these really quick. Hold on. All right, our bonds. Let's see. So we have different types of bonds. Special items. The anti versus pro. Got you. Man, there's so much to take in. And you have like other stuff you could actually get to for each thing. Like the level of just like... <laughs> detail it is insane. Like, you didn't think this was going to be, like, this complex on the outside, but after playing it, it's just insane. Please, this way. It's always a pleasure to see you. What happened to Harris? Uh, I've heard anything about the samurai. I'm sorry, but I really haven't heard much of anything. Out of interest, what precisely is your relationship? Not much of a relationship. Um, let's actually use the speechcraft. Well, 
If you say so. We know they were employed as a guard for Mr. Harris. If you wish to investigate, it might be wise to start there. Apparently, Mr. Harris has been in hiding since the incident. As to where he is, well... Why not try asking around at the Grand Villa? It's where Westerners mingle with the high and mighty. And then there's... Well... Let's just say there might be another way. I have some contacts in the Shogunate. If you are interested in doing a favor for them, I could make the necessary arrangements. Are you telling the truth is a cool way to go about it. I'm sure you recall what I told you when I asked you to take those photographs. I hear all sorts of things. Things the Shogunate likes to know. <laughs> you don't believe me, do you? Well, either way, I really do have something to ask you. Ah, now I think about it, there was one more favor I wanted to ask. I would be delighted if you'd see fit to aid me in this matter. So we got way different things here. Okay, we got... This path, which actually, I guess, supports that. And then we got the main one. My counterpart comes first. Let's go with that. Then, how about I share what I know of the Demon Claw Samurai in exchange for your assistance? I would like you to obtain a certain letter held by the Samurai of Mito. To do so, you will have to infiltrate their base. Once you have secured the letter, deliver it directly to me. Directly. Understood. If the samurai give you trouble, well, I trust you will know what to do. So, do we have a deal? Let's get it. Ah, dependable as always. Well then, head to the Hodogaya post. One of our allies will be expecting you. I can't get over how many times I died on that boss fight. <laughs> um, we can still talk to her. What does she actually have? Hold on. Is there anything have else? I how glad I am that you're here. Truth be told, there's a personal matter I wish to discuss. Whenever I get close to a certain row of abandoned houses, I feel like I'm being watched. When I turn around, no one's there. But I just know somebody's watching from some dark and lonely corner. Would you be so kind as to investigate and find out who's watching me? Uh, investigate. I'm busy now. Let's investigate. Why not? Thank you. What a relief. But do be careful while you're out there. Alright, inquire about the person who was after her. Okay. Wait, is this actually a main thing? Or is this... Hold on. Activating missions. Got you. Ronin mission, bond mission. Got you. This is a bond mission. So these are like the main ones. This is mission level 11? Oh, man. Uh... I'm tempted to start this one, but I feel like what's going to happen is... If I have, like, another boss fight of that, I don't know if I'll be able to actually do it right now. Okay, where are we going? This is right here. Let's just go try this out really quick, see what happens. I actually took damage there. Hold on. Uh, am I stuck? I don't know. <laughs> I was say, like, what are we doing? I think overall this game has been fantastic and the fact that we're kind of just like scratching the surface still is insane to me. I love that the horse actually goes by you when you hop on the horse because if that didn't happen I'd actually like look for the horse it'd be kind of weird I feel like. Some games it's different though. I feel like for this one it actually fits pretty well. So I'll do this one and just see what's uh, what's over here. I'm assuming it's going to say, like, zero out of seven thugs or something. 
Let me, uh... Let me take it easy when I get closer. Unless this is just like an interaction type thing. I wonder if this is a boss fight. I hope it's not. Can I break this? No. Oh, we're getting warmer. Hold on. Oh, it's in the other house. Wait, what is this all about then? Just collecting stuff, I guess. <laughs> Man, this game is awesome. I want to explore more of it and just try to like get 100% in certain areas. So we came through there, but I feel like going around the side is the way. Yeah, this is this is definitely the right way. So I got in about without a care. Easy. Oh, quickly you've forgotten about Hello? Kuros. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm getting. Hold on. You would pay for your treachery. I need to be careful because I'm probably going to die here if I'm not. Let me get back a little bit. Hold on. Raise banner. I was like, there has to be a checkpoint nearby. There we go. Let me actually touch the banner too. Reset everybody. <laughs> Just in case. Now I can kind of play and relax a little bit. Knowing if I die, it's not the end of the world. Okay, that person saw me, like, immediately. So I don't really know exactly. I could... Now, I'm assuming if you climb the house over there... How much damage does it actually... Does it do anything extra? I can't lock on, so I can't actually see, but... So I'm going about without a care. How quickly you've forgotten about Kuroki. If I can bring him over here, that would be really awesome. You would pay for your treachery. Might just I'm getting in closer now. My God, what was that? I wasted both of my hills. Wait, what? Are they stuck? What just happened? Got one left. Hold on. Is that floating? There it goes. It's a it's a person right there, isn't it? This might be like the head but person. Hold on. We're not done yet. I feel like this might be like. Never mind. Dressed like a ninja, he appeared out of nowhere with a message. He said, We have Taka at Benden Shrine. If you want her back, the traitor must come alone. And I heard from some others in the Pleasure District that Taka had asked your guidance on a matter. Please, if you know anything about this, you must save Taka, please! Back to the rescue. Come on. I wasn't expecting this. Hey! 
I'm not sure if it's like a time thing or what. Doesn't seem like it is, but just in case, I'll try to hurry. I mean, in real life, it would be. <laughs> As we run through fire. Uh, is there anybody else here? This seems like there might be a banner nearby. We can actually... Oh, wait a minute. Oh my god, boss fight. Easy. Double boss? Uh, hold on. There's got to be a banner nearby. There has to be. Probably gonna die first time, but it is what it is. There has to be like. Okay, it's just something you actually throw. Got gotcha. you. Yeah, I didn't see anything unless there's one back this way. I'm getting chased right now, so I don't know. Maybe it's like by the road or something. So they have like a dual life bar essentially, got you. Oh, there it is. Of course I find the banner. I knew it was like, it has to be over there. I'm dead. That's good though. I can actually reset. Maybe it lets me actually go to the banner this time. We'll see. All right, found the banner. We're gonna go fight and here we go. This is about to be nuts. Equipment, let me just make sure I have everything on. That's like the best of the best, upgrading it. Yeah, I need to go on a spree of just, like, upgrade. I think after this video, I'm going to, like, sit down and just, like, see what I can upgrade. 55 there. Nothing there. That's all the highest. What about this? This is just, like, the scarf accessory type thing. I need more of these. I got to go craft some. Um, I'll do it later, though. I should be able to do this. This feels like it's a boss fight, but it's also not overwhelmingly tough, it seems like. There's two of them, but they share a health bar. We've been waiting for this moment. You'll pay for breaking the code. Breaking the code. Okay, which one wants to fight first? If I could like sink them a little bit, that'd be so nice. Yep. It's like they just kind of take turns. Share the same. I guess not really. I want to fight this one first. Okay, okay. Nice. Okay. One down. The only and the only problem is I don't have any more heals or anything. I'm tempted to try something. Hold on. 
missing everything. I will be cheesy for this. I don't care. I was like, is he going to keep going? <laughs> uh, I don't know what to do here. Because uh, if I die... One more charge, come on. This might be enough. Let's go, baby. Oh, that was uh, a <laughs> little double boss fight there. My goodness. Let me... I wonder if I should go, like, rest because I have no more hills. Hold on. Loop before everything. Oh, I am glad to see your face. Even if you do look rather wretched. <laughs> well, thank you for your honesty. As I suspected then, it was your former kin who kidnapped me. Uh, I'm gonna say forgive me. Well, I suppose I could. Only if you agree to see me again. Don't tell me you thought I'd be cross. On the contrary. I'm rather glad you saved me. See? Do I look angry? Do you need a closer look? <laughs> I'm only teasing. I really am grateful, though. Seeing you show up to rescue me, I thought I was dreaming. But, of course you'd come. How could you not? We both have certain people we could not ignore if we tried. Ah, forgive me. I seem to be rambling. Kichi must be worried. I should go see her at once. Say, it would take no time at all on that dashing steed of yours. Why don't I hop on behind you and hold you tight? I'll see. We can both fit. A little shy, are we? Don't worry. I wouldn't dream of doing anything untoward. Man, we got something else now. Foreign books to see. Foreign knowledge can be found. We just got one, okay? Mount the horse. We got warm boots. Okay. Ray, I'm truly grateful that you came to my rescue. Thank you. I want to... Hold on. Can I dismount really quick? I guess I can't. If I get attacked, it's over. <laughs> now that I've learned about you, I feel obligated to share something of myself. Such a pleasant breeze. Being here with you, I somehow feel as if I can let my guard down. How sad we're nearly there. Dare hope I'm not alone in that feeling. If only we could just keep going, you and I, go somewhere far, far away. But, alas. Oh, Taka! It's so good to see you safe! I'm perfectly fine, Kichi. I'm sorry to have worried you. And thank you. Thank you for saving Taka. Not a problem. That was rough. I'm going to say not a problem. <laughs> I knew it. I knew I could count on you to help. Oh, I 
just mention, Taka, the guest you are expecting has arrived. Ah, oh, I see. Very well. Thank you. Now, let me introduce you. Since you so boldly came to my rescue, I feel I should return the favor by revealing a secret of my own. All right, let's see. I don't need to know your secret. I'm going to do the first one. <laughs> Once the cat's out of the bag, there's no putting it back in, you know. I'll be waiting in my room. Be sure to come by later. I gotta admit, this game went from, so like the first three videos, it didn't seem overly difficult. We had like that one enemy in the last video that was kind of tough, but this one, I mean, that boss fight earlier, <laughs> forget about it. That is so tough. All right, uh, hold on, let me see if this is actually, this is not an actual Ronin mission, so. I wonder, like, if I view details, let's see, relationship, bond level one, okay. Equipment, I do want to go through, and I'm probably going to upgrade before, like, the next video. Um, maybe, like, try to go around the map and just, like, farm enemies and stuff like that. If this is, like, the beginning of, like, another mission, I may not do it, but... Let me just see really quick. Do you know who I am? The Red Demon? Hold on. <laughs> a sobriquet of my ancestor. Though it seems some apply it to me. The truth is, in order to assist Lord E in his affairs, I've been keeping an eye on the expulsionists who frequent the Pleasure District. I wanted you to know. But you must promise not to breathe a word of this to another soul. Uh, why would you do that? Lord E is a long-time acquaintance of mine. I wish to be of service to him in whatever small way I can. Hmm. Any complaints? And before you insinuate anything, Taka does this for me willingly. Let's see, if you're doing this on your own, uh, volition fine, but speak the truth. Let's do that one. <laughs> Remind me, how long have you known Taka? I'd wager I'm a better judge of her intentions than the likes of you. That's enough talk about me, I should think. It's not every day you get an audience with a chief minister. Isn't there something you'd like to ask him? There's so many ways to go about this, okay. Ah, yes. I've heard stories. Stories about them collaborating with the foreigners. I'll keep my ears open, but I am a busy man and can offer no promises. I think we're done here. Try not to get in our way. All right, mission complete. Good way to stop the video. We got, let's just say really quick, hold on. Gifts, okay. So I feel like the game just, it almost feels like an RPG at this point more than anything. Like I'm just trying to keep up because there's, there's so many things going on at once. You got stances, you got different weapon types, you got bonds, you got... Uh, let me rest really quick, hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna go farm some, like, materials and stuff and craft as much stuff as I can before the next video. But anyways, love you all, best audience ever. I'll catch you on the flip side. Take it easy. Peace.